November 2022, Arikama Light Language. We align with the best light language. Meya kaye kakaya, dona takayet takayi, sonataya leya kayet kayo. There is much to learn about what you do and where you go. For in a moment, you can be let down a dark hole. Which thoughts to keep, which thoughts to let go. There are set programs already in your brain that fire and trigger out of any quality of despair, boredom, longing. But that does not need to be your focus. Breathing through these moments in time and allowing them to pass is the biggest feat that you can do. Because in this world, many are attempting to control, psychically control one another, with or without presence in the physical reality. It is our choice to listen to them or to raise up higher. Sona kayet kayi moya kakaya. You become most susceptible to these programs and past deeds when you forget your vibration, when you forget your truest alignment. Your truest alignment begins with a conscious choice in the morning when you open your eyes to be led by your body or be led by your phone, your errands, your tasks, the past, the constant bickering of what was and what is not anymore. It is your choice. Kaye papaye moya kakaya. When you choose consciously what is here to serve you, maya takaye nakayo. That is when your alignment will grow. This is a practice done just like exercising at the gym. You exercise your body and when you practice consciousness, you exercise your mind and body. For there is programming within the physical structure that needs to be dictated. That needs to be lifted. Maria watches so many people on TikTok who have changed the shape of their face just by a constant day and night shift up with a gua sha or with just their bare hands and some oil. They look good because they chose to look good. They look hot as you all claim to be the highest priority in your existence because they chose to look hot. And as a reminder, if you are thinking that physical presence equals hot, then you are led to be mistreated and ruled by only physical and exterior motives. Hot begins first with the truest alignment to your heart, to yourself. Aligning to your needs and your mission before any exterior display. That is true fire. That is true sexiness. Anyone can lead anyone down a rabbit hole of false pretense. And the moment you find out you've been led down a dark rabbit hole and not the light, the trust will never be given back. At least it better now, oh my gosh. Kaye sakaye. Maria is listening. Moya sakaye sakayo. We sing you a song. Everybody only sees what they only want to really be. When their mentality deems satisfaction, then there will be no need for searching for their truth. If the comfort overrides true authenticity, that is why many are asleep every single day. If the comfort overrides true authenticity, that is why many are asleep every single day.
because their needs are already met by the society given. Granted, a person who is, say, artsy, and it is harder for them to actually produce their work in a working employee corporate mentality society, that individual will be fighting day and night. But no need to fight. There is a lack of satisfaction and more of a trickling of frustration that can exist for those who dare to fight for their dreams. Once one realizes their comfort has been given under false pretense of a rabbit hole dug too far deep, led astray in a fictional fantasy of good and bad, only when one realizes that they have been led astray and their real eternal power has been stunted, laid idle, Will the society ever move out of the blank hypnotism of the screen? Peya papayet nakakayet nakaya. Who is leading you today? Kena nakaye kakayo. Are you being trapped? Kena kakaye kakayo. Are you trapping yourselves in the monotonous echo chamber of opinion? Pina papaya nakaya. Granted, we are talking to you too. But listen, it's a longer form of content. What more can you ask for? Kena papaya kaya. We give a new prayer for the human race. Actually, we give a new reality for the human race. Okay. Are you ready? A new reality for the human race. Congratulations. Look at you. Wise. Open-minded and facing the sun. Eyes up. Spine aligned. Realizing that the truth was always there no matter where or what was giving us back. You stood tall and strong into your heart center, into your gut feeling. You knew (laughs) each and every day what to choose. Ah, And you knew each and every day that it was always you. You who had the power within yourself. No need to go out there and make someone like ya. No need for you to go out there and do a little dance. For you were free the moment you said, Hey, that's not right. I'm going to do me today. Through your conscious effort of sustaining and keeping your frame no matter what pressures were put on you, real and fake, you kept your yourself your truest light you let your heart speak with its truest light you became honest for the first time in your life and you knew that no one and no thing could ever take away your power no one and no thing and no experience None of these things defined how brilliant you already were. From the moment you came to this planet, nothing and no one of how it should have been, nothing of how it could have been, you realize for the first time that everything you were looking for out there was already housed within yourself. And yes, this took some time to really digest. But because you had the courage, finally, to look into the darkness, you realized there was nothing to be afraid of. And the only one waiting to see you was yourself. Congratulations! More breath, more awareness, more fun, more abundance. Holla, baby. Comment, like, and subscribe. Until next time.